Hi everyone, this is Parul Chaturvedi and today our yoga practice is short quick sequence for strength and balance. Ideal for people who are very busy, busy parent, busy professional or if you're just starting to begin your yoga journey and you want to start with a short practice, this is ideal for you. So let's start. You're going to start in standing today. So standing with your feet grounded, okay. Just feel the first connection of your feet with the ground. Arms by the side of your body, palms facing front, relax your shoulders and just, just take a moment to connect with yourself. Observe how are you feeling right now. How is your physical body right now? How are you breathing right now? And then slowly start to settle your thoughts. And then gently take a few deep breaths. So just breathing in through your nose, take a deep breath in. And breathe out. Breathe in, like you're drawing the energy from the ground, breathe in. And breathe out. One more breathing in. And breathe out. Gently open your eyes slowly. Namaste. Let's continue with our practice. So we're going to start with a little balance and a stretch. So you're going to ground your left foot and lift your right leg up. Okay. You might find a little challenging at the beginning to find your balance, but uh, just look at one point to focus, breathe, nice one, very good, and release slowly, okay? Now, with the same leg, right leg, we are going to release our cords. So you're gonna take your right leg back, hold the outside of your right foot, breathe, and then again, focus on one point to find your balance. Pushing your right foot gently in your right hand. Breathe. And then you release slowly your right leg. You're going to repeat this on the other side now, okay? So ground your right foot. Lift your left leg up. Find your balance. Breathe. Take your left knee closer to your chest. Tighten your abdomen breathe and release slowly okay and now we're going to quad stretch so just bend your left leg hold it kick it back in your left hand focus on one point breathe and then you're going to release slowly okay now from here we are going to get into sun salutation. So, Surya Namaskar, coming to the front of your mat, joining your palms together, ground your feet and take your arms up and back. Breathe in, breathe out. You're going to fold forward, okay? Now, maybe you have to bend your legs, that's okay. Now, take your right leg back, low lunge, and then rest your palms down, left leg back, plank. Resting your knees down, bend your arms, chest chin down breathe out slowly lift up breathe in cobra then breathe out downward dog breathe in step your right leg forward breathe out left leg forward join your palms arms up and back breathe in breathe out hands back at the heart center let's complete this round arms back breathe in fold forward breathe out left leg back this time then your right plank knees chest chin down breathe out slowly lifting up breathe in cobra breathe out downward dog breathe in left leg forward breathe out right join your palms go back breathe in breathe out hands at the heart center i hope your body is now warm up if 
feel a little more energized you're going to go in warrior one so you're going to step your left leg back right leg is bent see the position of my left foot left toe slightly coming in hips are pointing in front square your hips and then you're going to take your arms up relax your shoulders take your tummy in okay don't float your stomach out take it in so you engage your abdomen your core stay here grounding your feet pressing in your left foot grounding your right foot breathe and then from here you're going to spin your left foot coming in warrior 2 so look at your right hand bend your right leg keep your shoulders soft arms strong yes keep your gaze looking at your right hand breathe stay here opening your hips finding strength in your legs breathe and then you're going to take your right arm out resting your right elbow on top of your right thigh taking your left arm up left palm facing down don't collapse okay breathe Stay here strong, and then slowly coming up, warrior two. Take your right toes out, and then we switch to the other side. So bending your left leg, right toes in, warrior one on the left side. Extend your arms up, soften your shoulders, hug your ribs in, and press your right foot back. left knee on top of your left ankle stay focused breathe and then you're going to slowly transition to warrior 2 this time looking at your left hand bend your left leg ground your right foot keeping your arms strong shoulders soft finding the strength in your legs and then from here side warrior extend your left arm left elbow resting down on your right left leg right arm up breathe slowly coming up left toes point forward narrow your stance slightly toes out goddess pose lower down your hips okay knees are pointing out toes are pointing out press into your feet arms forward breathe hold it here yes just for few seconds stay here keep lowering down your hips finding the strength from your legs your feet your core keep your chest open keep breathing for next 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 one lift up breathing in breathe out arms down okay spin your left foot we're going to go in warrior 3 virbhadrasana 3 so you're going to bring your left leg closer to your right leg and then you're going to lean on your right foot forward lifting your left leg up and take your arms back if you want to take any other arm variation you can do it and your left foot left hip left shoulder in line hips are pointing down your head is guiding you forward you're pushing your left heel back breathe and then from here bring your left leg back let's switch side grounding your left foot lift your right leg up flex your toes breathe arms back looking straight ahead focus stay here another 10 seconds Stay here another few seconds, and then you bring your right leg back, and we're going to go in chair pose, utkatasan, hips back and down, knees back. Okay, take the weight back on your heels, knees are not spreading out, knees are pointing forward, weight on the heels, strengthening your core, your back, your legs. Keep breathing. and then slowly lower down and we come in frog pose so open your legs wide 
pressing into your palms, pushing your knees out with your elbows, opening your chest, breathe. Stay here. And then slowly, you're gonna rest your hips down, extend your legs straight, and we're gonna do upward plank. Palms back, fingers wide open, pressing into your palms, point your toes, hips up. Remember, this is a sequence for strength. So, lift your hips up, don't sink down, make sure your fingers are wide open, you're pointing your toes on the ground, even if it doesn't touch. And slowly you're going to bring yourself back and bend your legs and arms by the side. We are in Nokasan boat pose. Relax your shoulders, open your chest, legs parallel to the ground, breathe. Stay here another 10 seconds, keep your spine long. And then slowly you're going to release and give yourself a nice hug for doing this for yourself. Taking some time for your self-care, which is absolutely important in our busy life. Stay here. See how are you feeling now. Connect to yourself. And then slowly you're going to release and we're going to end the practice with one chant of Om. Okay, so coming in your easy pose, resting your hands on your knees, sitting long, breathing in. open your eyes namaste everyone thank you so much for doing this short yoga practice with me i hope to see you again and have a wonderful day ahead don't forget to subscribe to my channel to support my channel and for all the new video updates do let me know in the comments below about your experience from today and if you have children or you know children who want to practice yoga do introduce them to my youtube channel for kids bliss yoga kids find the link in the description namaste